Good morning, guys. I've been in prayer already. That's why I have this on. Usually you see me without it and I'm dressed, but I've been in prayer. Um, I'm probably going to go back for a bit and then get dressed for church and then head off to church. Um, it's been a enlightening uh, morning for me, that's for sure. Uh, but yeah. So, I hope everybody has a wonderful Sunday, and if you can, get to a church. We need to be in prayer as much as possible now. Anyway, just wanted to bring this message to you really quickly, and um, I'll be back later. Um, then all of a sudden some set of people could claim look we told you so and it was all of those wicked and in this case as coincidence would have it I don't think this is a political Republican or Democrat thing but you could point at those Republicans if you were said group and say look they weren't following the regulations look these conspirators didn't want to wear the mask look they did not want to be herded like cattle had they just gone through the cattle herding like we said this new thing that has arisen um, wouldn't be affecting them like this. Yeah, it's a great plan, and it, it turns out that... And you would exactly want to be ultra healthy, healthy if that happens. Well, yeah. <laughs> I mean, but, but go ahead, exactly. Mike. I didn't um, you, you, you do everything you You a very, could. very good point. Right. The, the plans that I was told is exactly that. When, when a purposeful intent to lock everybody down, right. make them wear masks during a time that much of the public knows the threat isn't real is purposeful and in this just say appears to be in all of the i i, right. I, I follow what you're stating like go ahead right and it appears to me they're saying let's use a lot of words like appears and thanks and all okay good. Yeah, yeah keep going man so it appears to us that their plan is to draw out lockdowns mask wearing mm -hmm. and even allow the public to learn that the threat is not near as bad as it appears. So that's part of the agenda is actually to allow it to, mm -hmm. I mean, it looks like, right? And what they say in their own discussions is that then you're going to get a pushback from people who are tired of being locked down, tired of wearing the mask. And clearly you feel like they're being lied to. Yes. And then you that's, drop it in. That's right. Then you drop it in on those people right. would be the theorem. The new, then Cute. at that point, uh, what they have discussed themselves, right? From what I understand, is that that's when we introduce a new and a second more ve venomous virus, right? And then say, "See, we told you so." Doesn't the word "novel" mean it's a novel coronavirus? Well, you've done a lot of patents. What is what is? Novel? What's a common word you use when you patent something? It's novel. It's new. It's something somebody built or designed. And that's right. And that's not without one issues. document coming out of anywhere. That's just a lot of the title, common thing in the, title yeah, in the patent it, right? world. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And it is interesting that that isn't that something that 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 particular virus is patented, and right. the same group that has it is the one to say, "Oh, we got this 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 thing that we can give let you us a come shot." With it. Yeah. Let's yeah, come with some and syringes. You know, we'll heal you. Right. Isn't remember when we were first getting laptop yeah. computers? There's these viruses that hit your computer. Right. And then it turned out the same company who was creating the viruses were creating the software to protect you from the virus. Okay, so so the way I understand it, this group who is orchestrating this, as I understand it, their plan is to purposely make the length of time that you gotta wear masks and be locked down much longer that seems reasonable. And even to allow people to learn that most of the deaths and and danger isn't really real. Right. And in their discussions, it's to create people to get upset and push back saying, why are you doing this to us? And start resisting. Right. And to them, it's a way to identify people who resist being ruled. Now, once they have those people identified... Resist being... Yeah, that, that embrace freedom. And that's part of the knocking down of the stat, anything that represents freedom. So that if there was a takeover, a coup, is what this used to be called. Right. That you won't even remember freedom. That's right. That's right. So a great way to identify the people who push back and don't want to be right. moved around like sheep. 
Those are the people that Cattle will be. Is the word they use. That's go ahead, right. Go ahead. Those are the people that'll that'll show themselves, and then that's when their discussions say they'll introduce a second virus. It's herd immunity, tougher. right? Second virus. Keep going. I'm sorry yeah. to interrupt you. So that's when they plan to introduce a second virus, a much more powerful virus, and then say, "See, we told you so." Those people, those people resisting our rule, our uh, laws right. are the ones causing the problems. Are rebellious. See what they did? They yeah. caused this whole new epidemic because they're not putting the masks on. Right, and, and now you need the chip. See, we told you. I mean, this is absolute. So this is the. Uh, this is a written right. and discussed plan of action, just like this one here, which was started in the 1800s, in the late 1800s. And at this point, probably directed by AI programs that are stating push, back off, yeah. push, back off. Oh yeah. Go over here, push, back off, so it sees. And, it, and you can also see from a, you know the kind of people you can push to throw stones and to do these other kind of yeah. things that cause damage. And you know where to push the community so far, and then back off. Push the community so far, back off. Push the community so far and back off. Mm -hmm. And over time, I'm following. I'm following. Acceptance. We, yep. Acceptance. Yep. Push further. Right. They accepted here. Push further. They accepted here. Push further, and you've taken this much ground, and you've done it quickly. Mm -hmm. And particularly if you've used software programs to do it. Yeah. Walk me through what the things are. You had highlighted some of these. It's a full list of these. Um, I'd like to point out that the. Um, one of the letters in one of our past videos when you talk about the, the the Q letter which pops up a lot um, it's a well it's a resh combined well, the, the Q, this would be the 19th letter in the Hebrew alphabet would be the Kuf and it is a, a resh which in earthly terms or in modern Hebrew is going to be if couched in earthly terms is going to represent wickedness now if you do a resh in heavenly terms it represents the Godhead God himself head man God man the reason in earthly terms it represents wickedness is because of the fact that human beings now believe they are God. They are the God man. They are God themselves. They are playing gods. The resh. And it covers the Zion, the real Zion. These are the pre-Canaanite Hebrew letters. So it's two, uh, it's two parts, like the two trees that are combined into one letter. And the resh is the wickedness, spiritual wickedness of people playing God playing head man or god man is pushing down the real Zion. It is pushing it down in the combination of that unique letter. Also in that letter you've got the Resh and you've got the Zion. So those two letters combined would be the Zor, which means strange. Or if I flipped it the other way, it would be the Ra's, which means mysteries and secrets. So those two letters combined mean that you're in a time, 2020, of strange mysteries and secrets. Go ahead, Mike. That's pretty cool, wasn't it? Yeah, that's that's excellent. So after we read that first first part, which was outlandish, wasn't it? It goes on to say, our right lies in force. The word right Our right lies in force. Yeah. Their right, their right, rule us, their right is lies in their force. The word right is an abstract thought and proved by nothing. The word means no more than give me what I want in order that thereby I might prove that I am stronger than you. This is their document. This is their document. Okay. Our power in the present tottering condition of all forms of power will be more invincible than any other because it will remain invisible until the moment when it has gained such strength that no cunning can any longer undermine it. Stay secret. Stay secret until it's the too moment. Late. Until it's too late. Until Out everybody there conspirator. Until the moment. Right. Mm -hmm. Out of our temporary evil. We Out of our temporary evil. evil. Is that what it says? Yeah. This Out is actual their documents. Evil. How old is this document? This is 1890s. 1890s. This and was, then back this in was. the 1910s. And Henry Ford got a copy of this in early 19, well, 1910 and wanted to warn the people of it. Henry Ford, who made the cars, you, your company has Sunbeam in America. You make cars. Go yeah. ahead. Yeah. So it goes on to say, out of the temporary evil we are now compelled to commit will emerge the good of an unshakable rule which will restore the regular course of machinery of national life that was originally brought, terminated, by liberalism. By liberalism. That so the mechanism introduced. to use, the mechanism to use was liberalism. That's right. Even from the 1890s. Right. They in their documents admit, we control the media. Right. And we will introduce liberalism right. into the schools, in the colleges. Form. Yeah. 
and weaken the morality mm -hmm. to a point that she can introduce this stuff and it seems at bare minimum plausible it doesn't matter and and on and, and the other end of it that you've got enough force that you can quash those who would talk against yeah, who'd, who'd rebel right so they said this result using evil justifies the means let us however in our plans direct our attention not so much on what is good and moral as to what is necessary and useful for us to achieve our goals okay good and moral is that's not what that's not what's all about are right achieving now. the goals right the temporary evil must be done through the use of what they claim is liberalism to achieve our goals mm -hmm. which is total control so it says before us is a just like Nimrod. Which is just, oh yeah, exactly. Just like just like Nimrod. Just He's like the first Nimrod. guy to do it. He, he is the first guy to do it. Mike, thank you for shipping me during the coronavirus time. Okay, this stuff is. We pray against this right now in the name of Jesus. I pray, Lord Jesus. I pray over Mike's stuff. This this things he has made that I believe the Lord put on his heart. He hit a pyramid with a parasailing thing, and. Um, he walks today, and he didn't do it through vaccines. He did it because, number one, he loves the Lord. Number two, he followed the, these all of these pages. Uh, people that call themselves this Zion and that Zion, if they're not following the Bible, and they're not following the Hebrew Torah, and they're following something else, or some other spirit, or some other angel, or some other being of light, then it's, then it's not right. And would it be shocking that God put stuff, this stuff comes from a special section, because that's the only only thing that hasn't been messed with in the world, uh, from, uh, you know, the plants and the vegetables, they release documents that state, the government has. Mm -hmm. That there's really no more uh, minerals in the ground, so you're not going to find them in your plants. And that's why you began going to trees, and it's... You know, the same way the water goes up the tree and the minerals from the ground, because the tree is built from the dirt. The seed has a digital instructions to mm -hmm. make the tree. And the tree is built from the ground. And if that ground has no minerals... The tree won't have minerals. It won't. But uh, So you have used special sections of special trees. Um, and uh, we're shocked that God has things. We just pray over this stuff that Mike has. I pray over... These things here, there's been a fight. Uh, there's been a fight over anything of truth. And I ask for you, we're going to pray for your families on the other side of the screen. Possess the materic spirits to those who acquire for a wild love of liberty. Lucifer prefers friendship to satisfy the mind which holds an insatiable thirst for knowledge and understanding. We aim I might go ahead. What's important here yeah. is this is not a short-term plan. This has been going on for a long time. Right. Even until... And it will continue even if there's a reprieve for a while. Until they get their goal. Until they get their way. The same people, even in the time of Jesus, he warned us about. Yes. And what's interesting is they admit, before us is a plan in which is laid down strategically the line and form which we cannot deviate without running the risk of seeing the labor of many centuries, over 2,000 years, being brought to naught. Okay, so they're stating that in their document, that the labor that is going on for 2,000 years, should we fail, um, has been thrown brought away. to naught. Yeah, so we can't fail. There's no, right. there's no cost too much. There's no price too much. So here's a group yeah. for over 2,000 years that admit that We've been planning this for centuries. Don't let anybody know of our secret plan to rule the world and turn us essentially into cattle. That's what this is talking about. And it's herd immunity right now during the time that they um, uh, want to give you stuff that, uh, I mean, they're not giving you stuff from healthy trees, I don't think, right? Yeah. <laughs> uh, kind of doubt that. Yeah. Yeah. Th those do look neat, guys. I, I really, you know, Mike did help me greatly with the, um, uh, you know, I tell you, I didn't, I couldn't get help from any of the online vendors really. In fact, they, they jacked up the prices of my stuff, and I'm not stating they did that to prevent sales of it. But I, I began to say, you know, I just am going to build up the God in a Nutshell website, put streaming stuff on there that works, which has been a fight, and put it up where we can do the shipping on this stuff at a, at, at a cost that we can we can find out what they talked about. There's a strange common thread where each of these major kings said there was this guy who was illuminated. He was he 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 bared, appeared. He, yeah, he appeared to Just me. Appeared. And he said, I will give you success in your kingdom if you follow me. 
Now, before we tell them who it is, because they're going to see who it is. Yeah, tell yeah. Them, I want you to tell them about the, the this is, uh, so Mike, you own Sunbeam America. Mm hmm Okay, you developed Sun Power, and we're going to talk to you, over the next couple of days, I'm going to do some more records with, with Mike, and also with the Clements. We're going to talk about prophecy in these hours. It's not going to go the way people feel, but you've developed a lot of free energy stuff over the years. Yeah. A lot of it for your family. Yeah. Tell me about the rocket, man. Before, before well, we this, is the, this is the first of the products that we started to design that was going to go on the retail side, and the first of them were Rocket Fast Headache Relief. But then in making different formulas using different trees and plants, we wanted to approach a market of people that needed help that had neuropathy, uh, uh, Parkinson's disease, MS, uh, arthritis, things like this. But there was a side effect, and it was the greatest side effect. But, and, and, and we're very appreciative for guys that buy this for the male side effects side. That's terrific and that's valuable. But help us get the word out to more people that have these more serious ailments. And let's get more people talking about what real food, food from trees, can do for them. It, it and that's comes Rocket from, Man. Yeah, it, it comes from the, well, go over to the website at buyrocketman.com. Right. Buyrocketman.com or getrocketman.com. Either one will go there. Okay, I think what they're chanting is what is right what do racist pigs get? This particular prophecy was given on June 3rd of 2015. I want you to pay very close attention to all of the none of the words of any of these prophecies are trite. Pay attention to the words of every single prophecy and every little word and all the details of the words, even the spaces between words of every prophecy that I play you in this particular film. It may be one of the more important ones that I put together and make. Notice at the end of this prophecy, this is just a hint, hint and an example, at the end of this particular prophecy, he's stating that I am not afraid to speak. There was no reason to be afraid to speak in 2015. I call to you, Yeshua Jesus, the Christ. Lord, I pray for the banishment of every demonic recluse. I pray for the, a banishment of every demonic spider, everything that would crawl in the crevices who are ready to come out one neighborhood after the other in New Jersey, in the Bronx, Manhattan and Lord even along the sea I pray Lord today that you would reveal to us your will I pray today Lord that you would speak I am not afraid to speak every detail of the prophecies are important good people right now are afraid to speak good people you speak you stand up you bold up you do anything you come against anything that's going on you're a racist you're an evil dude whereas all of the darkness is emerging just like the prophecy says the spiders coming out from the neighborhoods it's the same image mm -hmm. that's astounding and we've got how a recorded how well it's this this guy that sort of looks like it could be either... No, 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 but they made statues. Yeah, they made We're statues of people are tearing down statues. Yeah, they put the this statue up. we saved the history. Mm -hmm. They put these statues up in every one of their So events. we know what the image of this character was that uh -huh. would appear before these kings. And they all agree. Over time. And they all... And, and, and these kings made statues. Right. Other things. Now tell us what the statues look like. Well, I was amazed to see that each one of the statues you couldn't because it might be recognizable. A, that's right. Somebody, yeah. So what if I was to tell you that you couldn't tell if it was a man or a woman? It could be that vague. Right. Of an and image. we're in an hour where it's this the sex. Is, the sex is the trying women, to be blurred. Yeah. yeah the, okay. Yeah. The division of the sex is blurred. This is getting interesting. And he had these points coming out of his head. Ah, you've shown me New York. You've shown me, Lord, how the enemy has once again planned something. But this time it is completely different. It is not like 9-11. There is nothing like it. This is the most strange infiltration that shall come upon your screens. It shall come upon you in your movie houses. It shall come upon the places of comfort and pleasure. And they shall infiltrate and they shall say we'll even black them out. We will even cause them to be so terrorized because there is darkness in one section and darkness in another section. Long Island and Babylon and New York all these regions we will blacken it out and then we will cause them to hear and understand that we are in charge you will not do this as you plan but the spirit of the lord says they play a very dirty game you're fighting against an oppressive left-wing ideology 
Right, like, like a, beams like, of light. Yeah, it's like beams of light, right. Right? like an angel of light. That's right. Coming out of the head. And he, the, uh, this was what, the light bearer, is that what that is? Yeah, he's a bearer of light. He's supposed oh, to be very, very beautiful. Mm -hmm. So so this this is astounding that statues. you can see that same statue throughout time. And it looked identical. Rooms. And this is who, and you will look at one of them and go, yeah, I've here. seen that thing somewhere in New York. Now, I'll tell you, there's a lot of, you know, in prophetic stuff that Kim was stating, he said that the, the enemy always has his eye on New York and he said and, he'll, and and Kim and the prophecies will always stay and we're gonna see Kim uh, Kim's family I mean uh, uh, over the next few days and talk about some heavy prophetic stuff mm -hmm. but um, that the spiders were gonna come out of New York and take over the cities and those same prophecies he's mm -hmm. stating that the the uh, there's some problem with the people gathering going through the summer and um, uh, that there was a nation itching for a new kind of war with America, but that the enemy had his eye on America, and this is not like 9-11, that should have two terms of this president, but New York and these kings that had come forth over time, so take us there, what does this being look like? <laughs> well, and where is its largest statue at? <laughs> It's in New York. <laughs> oh, coincidentally. <laughs> Imagine that. Uh, uh, coincidentally, yeah. yeah. Why uh, is there statue? a statue that is identical, the Statue of Liberty, to these same statues that each of these ancient kings had prayed to? Now, how did we get the Statue of Liberty? Well, when I was a kid, I was told that some artist overseas had an idea for a random statue, and he decided to make a copy of it and give it as a gift to the United States. Mm -hmm. But that's not it at all. This Where is did it a, this come is from? A, this well, is what the, this is the statue that we're I think this is another issue of a planned event where the people who are really controlling the country are really are, are, are making a huge effort to put an image of who they view their God this is, is God, yeah. for everybody to see. The light bearer Lucifer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for everybody to see. And yeah. so the systems are just pushing further and further. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. One of the things you've done over time is not just the health stuff, but it's also free energy. It's should Christians get a reprieve and there be no mercy. Mm -hmm. And th there's a possibility, prophetic stuff. That, I mean, um, we don't know what the Lord will do. Mm -hmm. I, I believe that the Lord is going to give us mercy. And if he does, we would use it well. Now, if we used it well, would we use it for vaccines or what would you do? Will you be taking some? You, I, I think we... Um, Pretty much established that. No, I won't do that. <laughs> right. Um, um, I think it would be a good, a good um, preparation for some times that might be a little challenging. Is to learn how to make your own power, to fuel your like own vehicles, mm -hmm, and to power and grow your own plants and feed your family. Nothing wrong. With that. These are smart moves. So we're heading off to church now. Like I told y'all, we would be doing. Um, I got a treat for the Sunday school kids. I'm bringing pieces of cake for them. In the, in the middle of the and service? chocolates. No, no it's going to be after. Uh, what Beth said was Abigail missed her, uh, to have a birthday too because of the restrictions. So downstairs, they're after the service, um, the kids are going to uh, have a bit of a technical party. So she's going to include Lucas in that party. So it'll be a Lucas Abigail birthday party thing. Hold on to the box. So that's nice, right? Uh, so yeah, awesome. <laughs> so we're going to head off to church now. And uh, hopefully today is a good day and everybody has lots of fun. And the sermon's good. Um, Not all of those cakes are only for the kids. You guys can have a piece too. Chocolate for everyone? Every kid? There's 20 pieces of chocolate and 20 pieces of cake. Inside, there's uh, 24 kids that are going to be in the make, Sunday school service. What do we make it? Huh? What do we make it? You 24. make it 24. You're included in that number. And and you have 24 cakes. 20. I have 20 pieces of cake and 20 pieces of chocolate. So whoever doesn't get a piece of cake can have a couple of chocolates or something to make but up for I not wanted, having cake. I wanted a, it like, but what if we don't get cake? You know, you have cake at home as well. <laughs> don't assume. What color is that? 
Uh, who cares, man? Let's just go and enjoy our date with the Lord. I don't care about cars. I mean, Lucas, dude, they're good cars. We're here at church. There's not really much people here. Not we're early. We're like 15 minutes early, y'all. <laughs> My baby. See ya, Now move. 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 Why are you gonna? <laughs> why are you gonna? Hey guys. So we're home now. Obviously, I'm gonna get undressed because, well, I somehow pulled a muscle in my back, and I can't stay dressed with my bra on with this pain. So I'm gonna get undressed, and then I have to do rice for curry because today's curry. And then I have to do calendar and school lesson planning for the for this week. There's so much more still to do. Luckily, I have help. Johnny is going to clean the living room and take care of that stuff while I do homeschooling stuff and weekly planning stuff. So I get help today. Usually I'm on top of it, but we had a birthday party yesterday and we kind of just like... We're so tired because we want how some how 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 about some real life uh, face without filter? I look a little bit the same, a little bit. Anyway, so we only had three and a half hours sleep. So we kind of just like went to bed last night and we were like, oh, we're just going to clean the already. So now we have to rush around doing everything before bed. Good thing is curry doesn't take that long to make. Clean everything in the morning. Then we woke up late. And then we were like, yeah. So now we have to get ready for church. And we'll clean when we get home from church. And now we're like, oh man, it's like. Four o'clock. You know what I mean? So the prepping will take longer than the cooking. Like the prepping itself, if I was to do it, takes me two hours. For Johnny, it takes like 40 minutes. And then the cooking takes about 48 to 50 minutes. So for me, it takes me three hours to make it. From start of the prepping to the end of the cooking. Johnny, it takes an hour and a half that's it so that's why uh, after curry's done we eat and whatnot it'll be easier for him to just rush around picking up and sweeping and then me during him prepping and making a curry I'll be doing school lesson planning weekly planning and that takes hours guys like literally it takes hours so basically for the rest of the evening until bedtime, I'll be doing lesson planning and, and uh, weekly planning on the calendars. I might be able to do an evening video after I put the kids down. We'll see. But until then, I'm going to go now, get undressed, start on the weekly planning. Oh wait, I have to do the rice first. Because I do the best rice, I'm doing rice first. So the rice will be done. Then it's just a curry to do. So I'm going to do rice as soon as I'm done getting undressed. Then I get to go do lesson planning and weekly planning. Because from now until bedtime at 8.30, that's what I'll be doing. Quite literally. Scallop! Scallop! You're going to crash me! Stupid. Scallop. Scallop is done. You have to see that the car.
<laughs> now I have to get back in my car. What's it? Which one should I save? Which one should? No, he's already on the ground. So, yes, and which one should I save? Which one should I save? Steve. Steve is hurt, and Skilla is gonna fall. And if I go that way, Steve will fall off the edge. Let's try. Yes, and which one should I save? Which one should I save? Yes, it, it, his heart is. Do you know God? Yes. And and God going to tell him which one to save? Yes. And then he's not going to save the other one. Oh, he's. It's not exactly like that. Save both of I should say both of them. God today? Yes. Other Christians? 